I'm Kurt with Winter's Performance, and we're going to talk about checking the oil level and filling the oil in your 8-inch quick change rear, like this 305 Sprint rear that we have here. Maintaining proper oil level is obviously important. Uh, too much oil will create excessive heat and wear in the rear, and too little oil is obviously never a good thing. Um, to check the oil in these rears, first thing you're going to do is remove the oil level plug, which is on the right side of the rear, just in front of the axle on these particular rears. And you're also going to remove the oil fill plug, which is just behind the axle. Fill the oil here until it reaches the very bottom of this inspection hole here. Um, once you've done that, if this is a new rear, you're going to want to wait a couple minutes. There's a shielded lower bearing in between the main cavity and the change gear cavity, and it takes a minute for the oil to make its way past that uh, shielded bearing into the gear cavity. And once it does, you'll just add a little more oil to top it off, then reinstall the two plugs, and you're good to go. If you're at the track and the oil is already warm, no need to wait. You can just fill it and go. We recommend using a high-quality semi-synthetic oil with Molly, like our 8090 gear oil, or a full synthetic like Mobile One 7590 gear oil. All the information that we've gone over here is also on the tag that came with your rear end, and it's also available in our catalogs, which you can view on our website, or you can give us a call and we'll mail one out to you.